We're hanging out at the Western Development Museum, a great place for families and kids to come during this winter break. Of course, right now I'm hanging out with Jenny and she's going to tell us about the Western Development Museum's Grandmothers for Grandmothers fundraising dinner that's coming up in March. Now, before we launch into this great fundraising effort, let's talk a little bit about the organization. What is Grandmothers for Grandmothers? Well, it's a, one of I think about 240 different groups all across Canada mm -hmm. and we support the Stephen Lewis Foundation yes. and we raise money for the grandmothers and their grandchildren that have been orphaned by AIDS in sub-Saharan Africa. So it's basically grandmothers helping grandmothers. And you, in fact, I'm very excited to be talking to you today because you, in fact, went to Africa and met these grandmothers that you help support. So try to tell me what that experience was like. Well, it was uh, just a couple of years ago, yes. we um, went with my husband and I, we went to uh, Malawi and we went to visit two amazing ladies, Ruth and Rosemary. We received such a warm welcome from them. Aww. It was just amazing. And they toured us around many of the areas where they had actually built centers. Oh. And their organization was called Consul Homes. Okay. And they'd actually built about 120 different centers all across Malawi. Everywhere we were greeted by grandmothers singing, dancing. They were so pleased to see somebody from Canada. Yeah. And the fact that we were supporting them was, yeah. was special to them. But we were really impressed by the strength of the, mm. of the whole communities and the yeah. resilience. Mm -hmm. We saw them building their own centers with bricks they had made by hand. Wow. They, they made the bricks out of the soil. We saw a health center, which they had built with their own hands. But unfortunately, there was no personnel, no drugs to actually mm maintain it. We were in very rural areas. I think I saw more poverty there than I'd ever seen before. Yeah. So, you know, we saw tremendous need which mm -hmm. made, you know, really inspired us to help. Yes. But also, you know, they they do an awful lot themselves, you know, yeah. they're not they're not helpless. They're amazing. Of People course. Are. That really puts a, a lot of meaning, you know, we, we're here in Saskatoon fundraising and, and helping a cause that's so f far away, but really mm -hmm. going to Africa, I'm so jealous. I think that would be an amazing experience. Of course, it wouldn't be possible if you weren't a part of Grandmothers for Grandmothers. In fact, there's a very special 10th annual fundraising dinner coming up for them right here at the WDM. So tell us a bit about the dinner. It will be a great evening. It will. It's March the 6th and okay. uh, we're having a, it's our 10th annual as you said, nice. so it's going to be a bit of a celebration. Yeah. You know, we're going to have balloons, we're going to celebrate. Yeah. Nice. And uh, yeah, and in that time, those 10 years, we've raised, uh, this group in Saskatoon have raised over three quarters of a million. So wow. a few years we're going to reach the million mark, so we're very proud of that. The dinner's going to be fabulous, there's going to be a silent auction. We're having Joy of the Fox as entertainment, so they're going to be singing for us. So again, that is on March 6th. It's the 10th anniversary fundraising dinner for Grandmothers for Grandmothers. Tickets are available through McNally Robinson. Thank you so much, Jenny. Oh, you're very welcome. Thanks so much for having me.